Are you facing slow internet speed on your Windows 11 PC? In this video, you will see tips to increase the internet speed on Windows 11. Before we start this detailed guide, press the like button and subscribe to our channel in case you forget later. How to increase internet speed on Windows 11 Check your modem. Before you do anything else, make sure that your modem is in good condition and is properly set up. If it's not, that might be the reason why you're experiencing a slow internet connection. Try to troubleshoot it or call your service provider for assistance. Let's thank our sponsor Malwarefox for this video. Malwarefox gets rid of hidden malware from your computer. It is a simple yet effective anti-malware software providing protection against adware, spyware, ransomware, keyloggers, and all modern cyber threats. Check the description below to download for free. Reboot your computer. Sometimes all you need to do is reboot your computer and that can fix the problem of a slow internet connection. This is because some programs might not be working properly or there might be some conflict going on between them. A reboot clears all that up and gives your computer a fresh start. Disable unnecessary programs and services. One of the most common reasons for a slow internet connection is that there are too many programs and services running in the background and unnecessarily consuming the network. This drastically slows down the browsing and downloading speed. To check if unnecessary programs are running, right-click on the Start menu and select Task Manager. Now click on the Network tab to sort the programs using the Internet. This way, you can know which programs and services consume heavy network bandwidth. Then you can select them and click on End Task to close that program. Temporarily disable Windows Defender Firewall. Since the internet speed depends mainly on your connection, if there is a firewall program blocking it, that might significantly impact the speed. So you can try temporarily disabling it. To disable the Windows Defender Firewall, search for Control Panel and open it. Select System and Security. Now select Windows Defender Firewall. From the left side, select Turn Windows Defender Firewall On or Off. Choose Turn Off Bullets for both public and private networks. Now check your internet connection. If it is not fixed, you should enable the firewall to prevent unauthorized access. If you keep it disabled, your PC gets vulnerable to attacks. Change the DNS server. DNS servers are basically an internet phone book that translates the domain names into IPs. Though most users connect to their ISP's default DNS server, you can switch to any third-party DNS server like Google Public DNS or OpenDNS for better speed. Right-click on the Start menu and choose Network Connections. Click on Advanced Network Settings. Click on More Network Adapter Options. Right-click on your network adapter. Click on Properties. Then select Internet Protocol Version 4. Click on Properties. Click on Use the following DNS server addresses, then enter 8.8.8.8 in the first row and 8.8.4.4 in the second row. Click OK. Now check your internet connection. Change your router's MTU settings. MTU, or Maximum Transmission Unit, is a value that determines the maximum size of packets that can be transferred in a single transmission over an IP network. Routers use this value to decide which packets to forward and which ones to drop. If the MTU size is not set correctly, it can cause problems with the internet connection speed. To set the correct MTU, log into your router, then locate the MTU setting. It's usually in Admin or WAN settings. You should set a smaller value than the current one, but greater than 1400. Save the changes and restart your router. Turn off metered connections. Open settings. Select network and internet. Now select Wi-Fi. Then choose your current connection. Scroll down and see if the metered connection is on. If it is, disable it. Configure Windows Update Delivery Optimization Windows has a built-in feature called Windows Update Delivery Optimization that uses your computer's bandwidth to download updates and apps from other Windows 11 computers on the same network. You can adjust the uploading and downloading bandwidth using this. Open the settings. Select Windows Update. 
Now select Advanced Options. Then select Delivery Optimization. Click on Advanced Options. Now configure the upload and download bandwidth. Use Ethernet instead of Wi-Fi. If you're not happy with the speed provided by your internet service provider, it is time to switch to Ethernet connections. Though most laptops and desktops do not ship with an Ethernet port these days, you can purchase a USB adapter online or from any computer hardware store nearby. If your router supports Ethernet over Wi-Fi, it is also a good idea to use a wired connection whenever possible. That's it for this video. If you have any questions and suggestions, drop them below and share this useful video with your friends. Like the video and subscribe to our channel. Your likes and comments motivate us to create such videos. Don't forget to press the bell button to receive alerts for videos on Windows 10 Tips and Tricks.